Hello and welcome to Brothers Forge Gaming, taking a look at WWF Warzone on the Nintendo 64 system of entertainment. Looking at another clean sports. Uh, you know, they made a couple of these wrestling games. They're not, uh, what I would say, a great wrestling game. Um, if you watched our other video of Attitude, uh, you know, I won't cover some of the same things, but these are among the games, you know, we're bringing you some of the lesser, uh, what we would say, wrestling title. Uh, you know, eventually we'll get into the good stuff, but right now we're just going to bring you Warzone. Now you can create player options, that kind of thing, high score, biographies might be kind of cool. Um, so, you know, you can do all this different stuff, figure out the buttons, controller setting up. You know, I'm a big fan of the, the games that have the option screen, especially, you know, when you're buying games and, and loose games and all that, they don't have the book. Uh, it can it can be a little bit harder to, to get to figure out the game. So let's go ahead with some training. Oh, man, look at that pretty baby face boy right there. Guess we'll be Stone Cold. Because why? Stone Cold says so. Okay, so it's gonna tell you. You know, I like this. It's got the tr it's got the training, but you know, we're gonna skip that. <laughs> Who is that? Like Dusty Rhodes or somebody crazy? Uh, one of those old old trainer guys. Anyway, so let's go start game. Let's just get into it. Let's see what we got. Yeah, you know, challenge verse. Oh, cage match, weapons match. You know, Royal Rumble. God, you could face the gauntlet. But let's just do uh, versus. Oh, is that the heartbreak, kid? Uh, you make your own guys. Moss Thrasher, obviously Kane. Shamrock Undertaker. Dude, Owen Hart. Wow, he kind of looks a little bit like Zack Ryder in that picture right there. It's crazy. Woo, woo, woo. Oh, uh, you got the excellence of execution. Oh, baby, the rock. Huh. Mankind. Triple H looking more like, uh, who was that, English, whatever he was called when he first came into the league, uh, the hell was that guy's name, I don't know, the Pilgrim of something, uh, some, it's escaping me right now, but, uh, there you go, Gold Dust, Rook, British Bulldog, let's go with some people who might have some, some interesting, um, interesting ring entrances. Oh, it pits me against the excellence of execution. Bret Hart. No entrances. This capacity crowd is on their feet. Rough. Hello everyone, I'm Vince McMahon, and I'm good old JR. <laughs> but you get Vince and JR. Rocky Maivia, the first third generation superstar in the WWF. You have to be impressed with this rookie sensation. Bret Hart is one of the most technically sound wrestlers in the sport. This isn't about popularity. He's the king of the hill. <laughs> That's funny to have to hear uh, Vince McMahon talk about Bret Hart. He probably oh, didn't yeah. like that. That wow. Lock huh. Maybe I should have done some training. They hook it up. Oh man, he's excellently executing me. This is not good, folks. I don't know the moves. I'm doing a running lariat. Got to punch him. Tried to go for the back. Oh, we got, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, yeah. The ch I don't think The Rock has ever done the chicken wing kick. Okay, so it looks like you get some kind of power meter. Um, until you get stunned, and then maybe once they're stunned, you can go for, say, a power move. Ah, oh, darn it. So that's like a cheating kick that he has. <laughs> oh! He's out on his feet! Oh, he was about to do the mud hole stomping. Oh, yeah. Atomic drop. He smells a victory here. Oh, yeah. Looks like you pick him up if you hold the grapple button. But, you know, you mess around, you get a freaking swinging net breaker followed by a drop toe hold going into the submission. Oh, no, but look at this excellent executing Bret Hart. Oh! Let's go with the classic DDT. Oh, no. Go with the leg drag, whip, 
see if I can't get some, how do you do some submissions? Oh yeah, so see if you get up and hit one of the attack buttons, they do that little move there. No, no, no. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh. It looks like his life bar is wearing down a little bit more each time you uh, knock it down. Uh, grab the leg. One, two, two. Oh, it's a missile. <laughs> Ow, did he just slap me? Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Trying to figure out how to do the, uh, you know, everybody's favorite people's elbow. Ah, uh, darn it. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Leg drag. Or leg whip, whatever you want to call it. Haha, <laughs> take that, Bret Hart. Uh-oh, so that's how you climb out of the ring, is up, see? And they stayed stunned for a while, so you can really do some stuff. <laughs> Has anybody ever seen The Rock do that pin before in their life? Well, there you go. If you have, let us know. Yeah, he should have. Oh, that animation is terrible. He kind of looks like he has uh, some kind of disorder. Uh, but that's what you get. You get you get that. Uh, the, the the fighting is a little bit is a lot like the WWF Attitude game. I think Acclaim made that one too, or, or you know. So this is basically the same game as that other one. They just sold you it. It's a little bit more fluid though. So uh, take your pick. Like I said, there's some much better wrestling games out there. WrestleMania 2000, uh, No Mercy, Revenge, WCW Revenge, WCW World Tour. Uh, so go pick those up. Get a couple buddies. Uh, one, two, three buddies, whatever. Four people can battle it out and make pay-per-views belts. Anyway, for the time being, thanks for watching our video. And keep checking out our channel. Subscribe. Like our stuff. Uh, you know... Help us out in that sense. Thank you so much for watching Brothers Forge Gaming.